Hey Jelly Bellies, it's Trish, and this is a Dollar Tree haul. Da, 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 da. Want to give a heads up if you haven't seen my Days of My Melts, which I just put up. I filmed it two days ago and then forgot to put it up, so I just went up today. And this is going to probably go on, uh, put up right after that. Um, if you hear me wincing in pain if, and you haven't watched that video yet, um, I told you guys uh, last Dollar Tree haul I have fluid in my ear and, you know, all that type of stuff. Well, I went to my new primary, which that's a whole other story for a whole other day. But she checked my ear. She said it was fine, but she feels like, um, for you guys that have been around, I was supposed to get, you guys, I think, remember, I, I told you guys I needed an MRI on the same time that my dad passed. And I just couldn't go through with it and I ended up having a, pan a panic attack and that's when they started. So she really feels like I really, really need the MRI. She's like, I'll just give you uh, two Ativans. You can take one. And I'm like, I'm taking two. She said I could take two. So I'm not like abusing drugs. <laughs> but she's like, you take one and see if you need the other one. And I'm going, I'm going to need both of them. I hate these damn things. Well, how do you feel about MRIs? Post below. Anywho, I'm rambling. But if you hear me wincing in pain, it's because my right shoulder. I'm holding it with my left hand, which I normally do. But if you hear me, eh, that's because right on my neck. It's like right behind my ear, down my the side of my neck and into my shoulder. It's the most uncomfortable pain in the world. It doesn't like severely hurt now, but sometimes at night or if I talk a lot, especially after I do videos, of course, I'm going to be hurting. I try, I can't even lift anything with my right arm, which is hard because I'm a righty. But anyway, let's get to the Dollar Tree haul. All right. Today I picked up two of the Arnold Palmer half, um, half lemonade, half iced tea, which I was never into until, uh, Dunkin' Donuts came out with the, the frozen half iced tea, half lemonade. It's just that I like everything half lemonade, half iced tea. So I got two of those. And then Connor loves these, which I can't complain. He wants to eat dry fruit. It's He can eat a whole bag for 70 calories. Go for it. So I got us from the apples and the peaches. He doesn't like the banana ones. I don't like the banana ones either. Like, if I want a banana, I want a real banana. You know what I mean? I don't know. They're, they're like, too oddly sweet for me. But I picked those up, and then I got myself a bag of the pretzels because I mouth through those. Got to cut back and lose a little bit. And then, hold on. I got to change hands. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Um, bought myself a bag of Brim's popcorns because I am obsessed and some cotton candy and Connor's favorite which is the Elts No Salt added potato chips I gotta tell you for no salt these suckers are good and I'm like well I used to be really into salt but not as much now but like I still like on chips I always like salt you know what I mean or french fries but these I don't know what it is they're really really good if you're like, if you want chips, but you have like a sodium problem or a cholesterol problem, try these out. See how they go for you. I just noticed this bag is normally a buck fifty. Dollar at the doll tree. Oh yeah. And then I found some more of the belly flops. So I got two bags of those because I gotta have my what? My what? Jelly bellies. And then focus on its own. I'm so proud of you, camera. I'm petting the camera. Pet the camera. Pet the camera. And then I got some of the Brim's cheese popcorn because I'm obsessed with popcorn lately. Um, I picked up a container of the uh, Lay's Stacks for Connor because he likes those. And I know boring stuff. I got napkins because we go for napkins like it's going out of style. Then I found two of the new washies. These are, um, there's like, I think there's two of the designs that I didn't see that I want. I forgot which ones that they look like, but I thought these were really cute. The ones that I found, this one with the little umbrellas is really cute. And the numbers. Oh, and by the way, I will be doing that D Stash video soon um if you if you've never heard of a d stash video basically i'm gonna put up stuff that i'm not using in my stash of dollar tree stuff and um i'm gonna post prices and all you gotta do is pay the price that the item is plus shipping to wherever you are or if it's like a lot of stuff you need a big box of shipping for a bigger box whatever it is and i send it out to you so because mama needs some money <laughs> because <laughs> there's lots going on because Connor's birthday is coming up and I'll show you something that I actually bought for Connor's birthday and I almost burped and I didn't don't you hate that um so yeah I got these two and I just thought they were really really cute and then I thought this was a door I actually found a happy 11th birthday card because Connor could care less what his cards look like so it says happy 11th birthday I know my baby's gonna be 11 <laughs> oh when that happened it says you doubt no doubt about it you're truly awesome hope your birthday is too thought that was cute but this bag i was dying over this bag because i thought it was adorable um for any of you who has had, uh, knows a child or a male child at this age 10 11 12 13 
nine. This looks so much like Minecraft. I was like, oh my god. But this is says his birthday mode. I thought that was adorable, and he loves Minecraft. Like his birthday theme is Star Wars, but he loves his Minecraft too. So I thought that was so cute. So I picked up that bag for him. And you can't tell him this is between me and you. We went to the Target today. I was hanging with uh, Christopher. So I was like, oh, while I'm here, why don't I pick some stuff up? Well, this is the main gift that I'm giving him. Which is the Hyrule Warriors Legends for the 3DS. Because he wanted it on the 3DS and he loves anything Zelda. Which is hilarious because... Like, I was hardcore into the original, you know, Zelda for Nintendo, the gold one, and that's, yeah, you never push reset because it would screw up your game. And then his dad's supposed to be getting him a uh, yokai watch. It's this thing that you put these little discs in, and they have these little blind bags. Now, for anybody that saw my Instagram, this is what a blind bag is, like a bag. Sometimes you have boxes, and it's a surprise what you get inside. But I got these. Um, I think at Walmart has Series 1, but at Target, they actually had Series 2. And I know his father's going through Walmart to get it. So at least I'll have some Series 1 and Series 2. But I bought him three bags of these and the video game. I might get something else. I'm not sure. I'm still going back and forth, but... Uh, I have more than enough room in there to put all that, but shh, don't tell him what I got him. It's between me and you guys. Shh. <laughs> but uh, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, please post below, or you can email me, DM me on Instagram, catch me on Snapchat, smoke signals, sign language. I do understand a little bit of sign language. I know the alphabet, and I know my numbers, and I know a couple bad words, and I know, <laughs> I know more eat, play. Ooh, that would be a cool video. Who would want to learn sign language? Because I think it's a very valuable thing because I, I learned sign language because I was in a very advanced, and this makes me sound like a, such a nerd. I was an advanced student in elementary school. So we got to go out and do like a special reading group and we learned how to do sign language. And we, we uh, For Christmas, we did a, uh, we wish you a Merry Christmas, but we all did it in sign language. Plus my mom's best friend at the time, um, she knew sign language, so I learned it from her. But if you guys would ever want to see a sign language video or uh, how to learn certain things in sign language, I've been wanting to learn more. So it could be a progress between all of us if you guys ever would want to do that. We could start with the alphabet, which is super easy. And then we can do numbers. I can, I can do one to ten. And then I can work on more. And like I said, um, especially with autistic kids, learning the words more, eat, and play will change your life. and we'll, Seriously, we'll get your kids talking. Anyhow, if you'd like to see that, post below. The stash video is coming soon. I'm waiting for my arm to feel a little bit better. Hopefully, I can get that MRI done soon and get this stupid thing out of the way because I hate them. Woosa. Anyhow, thank you guys for watching. And always remember to what? Jingle until you tingle. All right, thank you guys for watching. Bye.